Hey boys, welcome. Welcome to a brand new series, although it's not... We're bringing it back from Rugby League Live 3, the Young Guns career mode. Um, as you'll see, I don't go through the full list here, but you'll get a good idea of who's in the team. I um, There are like a few like backup players, but the, the core squad will be fairly similar uh, for the whole season, barring like injuries and stuff. Um... But yeah, I try to keep it, I think every player should be 21 years or younger. There might be one or two that are like 22 years old. I tried to like make sure they're only 21. Uh, so like a few a few omissions, you know, there's no like Milford. Uh, I think Tamalolo was in the team in Rugby League Live 3. Uh, who else? I mean, Corey Oates was there. Yeah, there was a, it's a fairly different team, which is, which is cool, it's, it's, it's fairly, fairly different, I guess, it is a couple of years since I, well, it, I, uh, yeah, I guess it is like a couple of seasons in the game, um, since I did the Rugby League Live 3, or would it be, it's sort of, yeah, it's around that time, but, um, first off, I do want to give a, sh uh, <coughs> give a shout out to, uh, to Millsy, he, uh, he offered to uh, to make me a thumbnail for uh, for this series, so that is that is the thumbnail that I'll be using. So that is greatly appreciated. The Tigers are going to come in for the first try with James Tedesco. It was a good little ball to the outside of the defender. I think it was Jaden Braley. Try to come up for the intercept, didn't get the ball, didn't get the man. So poor play. But yeah, thanks uh, thanks to Millsy. Uh, his link will be in the description. I'll probably put it in the comments section as well. Um, he posts some Rugby League Live 4 videos, so go check him out. But yeah, it's uh, it's always appreciated when people just offer to do that sort of sort of stuff for me. So yeah, we're uh, we're back into the game. But yeah, I'm excited. I am excited to to get this series back underway. I guess for Rugby League Live 4, it was one of the funner series I did in uh, Rugby League Live 3. Is right here, last tackle. Go for a little bit of a bit of a sneaky play there. And it's going to come out the back to Coleman Hess. A beautiful long ball out to Jaden Braley. And this is the stuff I, um, I'm keen for. It's just, it's just throwing the ball around a bit more with um, with the young guns. That's what I tried to do in Rugby League Live 3. You know, I played a little bit more expansive. You know, playing with a young a young team. A bunch of like, uh, you know, it's a good team. It's a good quality team. We uh, probably our forwards are probably the weaker aspect but we have some we have some decent forwards like our back row especially is very solid with uh Crichton, Cohen Hess and Sione Nataldia. So yeah it's pretty good. It's right here again just um throwing the ball around, getting the zero tackles there as well. So the Tigers they're they're a fairly young team themselves but they're up against uh a, a bunch of confident youngsters is right there. The offload and then inside ball would have worked well, but it was called forward. So that's uh, you know that's something we gotta get used to as well. Those sort of risky offloads are gonna they're gonna come back to bite us eventually. As uh, just before halftime break, we're looking to hold them out. Ashley Taylor, a big tackle on Chris Lawrence, and gonna go in six all. Um, fairly fairly even. I see the completions from us are just dreadful. That is. That's uh, that could be a trend as well, but hopefully we can uh, hopefully we can pick it up a little bit. It is wet conditions as well, and yeah, it is the Auckland Nines at the same time, so it's not going to be you know there's a lot of space to move, a lot of a uh, lot of opportunities to throw the ball around. As uh, Kalen Ponga playing on the wing is going to burn Tedesco, went for the diving ankle tap, but he is not going to get round up. And Kalen Ponga superstar on the wing for us. I. Uh, it was tough because obviously Trebojevic, I had to put him in the team as well. But um, I was thinking about putting Kalen Ponga in a fullback, Trebojevic on the wing. But uh, we went with Trebojevic at fullback. I, you know, I might eventually like switch him up for for a couple of games. Ponga in a fullback, Trebojevic can play on the wing. But yeah, it's it's a solid backline, and we've got a few like good good uh, substitutes on the you know in the in the wings if we get an injury. As uh, LOA there, a, uh, a good line run, picking up uh, a good line break, and then a pretty decent kick on last tackle. It's perfectly placed, and uh, Chaboyevich is going to get pushed back into the end goal. So it's been a it's been a pretty solid game of nines footy here to start the season. Pretty good entertainment from both sides. A little kick going in there. Uh, I think it was before the last tackle. So you know, a little a little silly as we do 
Uh, I was wondering what happened, but it was actually, it was a knock-on, apparently. I thought he got a little kick to it, but it was a knock-on as a, right here, I don't know what the Tigers were doing there. They they were not numbering up at all, but then we totally squandered it. I, <laughs> I just thought we had to get the pass out, but our support play wasn't quite ready for the line break, so we didn't get to it uh, in time. And then the ball out to Lola here. Uh, nice bit of play, actually. So, that comes back to bite us, like, we, <laughs> off the scrum, like, we had so much room to move, there was a massive hole, and if we got the pass to one of the outside men, we would have scored, but they just weren't quite up with the play, so should have just taken the tackle, but, yeah, you know, that's, that's how it goes sometimes, right here, looking a few change of directions, just throwing the Tigers for a bit of a loop, gets it out of Crichton, and the huge right foot step, little pass on to Nick Kotrick, and it's going to be a pretty impressive try to uh, to, to the young winger, Kotrick. Very, very good player. Only 18 years old, I think. Maybe 19 now, but very, very solid player. Uh, and that was, that was a pretty, pretty decent ad-lib try. It was a little sloppy, a couple of passes, but then beautiful footwork from Ingus Crichton off the right foot and then just drawing a passing. Uh, good stuff. So that is going to be our first win with the Young Guns. Hopefully, you guys are going to enjoy the new series. Make sure to like if you are, and uh, I will see you guys in the next one.